Two Broke Rednecks present Sophie the Germ Fighter. Da 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 da! You sure that doesn't mean awful film? Sophie the Germ Fighter? What sort of superhero name is that? Bishop to Queen Seven. Why are we watching a kid fondle himself? Billy Martin is one of the nicest boys in our town. He's one of the cleanest boys, too. And one of the drunkest. Billy always has been a nice boy. But he hasn't always been so clean. As a matter of fact, for a long time, Billy's parents worried about him. They didn't worry just because Billy... Hey, it's Pigpen! Broke back Mountain, the early they years. They knew that a boy is bound to get dirty when he's playing cowboy and runs into a bandit down by the corral. Billy's parents did worry because he was so careless about washing when he should have washed. He had to be reminded... Harry Palms. Told you it would cause that. Then he didn't do a very good job. The trouble was, Billy had the wrong idea about being clean. Wash, wash, wash. They just want me to be a sissy. You sound like a sissy. But then, one night, Billy had a dream. At least, I guess it was a dream. I bet cowboys don't wash all the time. But you're wrong, Billy. It's not sissy to be clean. You know they have medication for hallucinations. I did. One of your best friends. Let me introduce my... Ah! Soapy's the name, partner. Why? Quick! Kill it! A living cake of soap. Big as life, Billy. And I'm here to help you. I can help you, partner. Experience the world of child molestation. That's just the trouble. It looks like a baked potato and a bar of soap had a kid. What a good friend I can be. So I'd like to show you. May I? Why, yes, I do. Well then, just lie down and close your eyes. And just and relax your eyes. cheeks. Now, what do you see? Why, I see a cowboy. He's washing up. That's right. There's nothing sissy about that cowboy, is there? He's a bronco bus. The amazing melting man. Will someone get this fat ass off of me? Well, Billy, you and I must tame animals more dangerous than bucking broncos. I help you control animals that could make you sick. And make you see talking bars of soap. Close your eyes again, and I'll show you. The animals I help you control are called disease germs. They are so tiny you can't see them. I don't want to see an internet troll's genitals. Using. Disease germs are dangerous. Professional minesweeper never caught on. Too many of them get inside of you. And they can be on almost anything that children touch or handle. Even on things... I will eat your soul! Money, it's a blast. Just keep your hands off my stash. In your eyes. Or in your mouth. Those disease germs can get inside of you. And do very naughty things. But you and I can kill most of the germs on your hands. So they can't make you sick. If we work as partners. So Great, he's plotting genocide. Learn good hand habits. Boys and girls should wash their hands often, especially at certain times. Like after wash your wanking hands it. Before doing anything that has to do with food. Before handling food in the kitchen. Nothing like soapy salad. Before setting the table. Before and after you murder someone. Before eating at any time.
And always remember to wash your hands before brushing your teeth. And before scratching your ass. Wash your hands after doing anything that gets them very dirty. Like finger banging your girlfriend. After playing games. After playing hide the sausage. After playing with animals. And especially after going to the toilet. And don't forget to wipe your ass. You and I can be partners in You other mean sexual partners? partners? We can do a Should we be seeing this? Each time you bathe all over. And of course you should take a bath or shower each time you've been working or playing hard. Not this must be what Saturday porn was night. like for Michael Jackson. You should wash your hair often. Boys can do it easily, each time they take a bath or shower. Girls should wash their hair at least once every two weeks. I wash mine daily, you nappy hoe. You can see, Billy, that I am your partner. But you have other health friends. Every community has a health department, just as it has a fire department and a police department. And one of your best friends is the health officer. He's a germ fighter, too. It was 7.38 a.m. on a Monday when we got a report that germs were gathering at the dock. They know how to look for germs. This health officer is testing a drinking glass from your school cafeteria. It's not the one the kids use, but one set aside for such now tests. The health officer checks the cafeteria windows to be sure that flies can't get in. Because school cafeteria food is considered too cruel a way to kill them. Got a lot of cows to screw today, Bob. Yep. Health officers must see that cows are clean and healthy, so their milk will not have germs. Nice knowing you, Bessie. Enjoy being steak. Another health officer, the meat inspector. Make sure that meat is clean and safe. That doesn't look clean to me. What gave it away, the blood or the scabs? But health officers can't do everything for you. You must be your own health officer, Billy. Inspect your gun twice daily and be careful in case it accidentally goes off, if you know what I mean. Be sure that food is clean before you eat it. Be sure that dishes are clean before you use them for food. Be sure your mom is clean before eating her as food. Never take a bite from someone else's food. That's a good way to get the shit slapped out of you. Break off the piece to share your cookie. And keep food covered, safe from flies when you eat outside. But it's all right if they're inside. They carry dangerous germs on their feet. When you drink from a glass, be sure that it is clean. Don't rub your wine in it. Your own drinking glass. When you drink at a fountain, keep your mouth away from the nozzle. Or else you'll get an STD. And there's one more important thing, Billy. Don't tell you anyone you saw me because I'm on probation for shit like this. You know, a cowboy wears working clothes when he's out on the range because he gets dusty and dirty. But when he's ready to go into town, after I've helped him wash up, he puts on his clean clothes. Which ironically are tomorrow's working clothes. Children get dusty and dirty when they Is the bullseye play. in the window so drive-by shooters know where to aim? But when you're through playing, when you clean up for dinner, you should change to clean clothes. Cause mom loves doing laundry. Really, being clean in every way is an important part of being healthy. And being healthy is an important part of being happy. I see that now, Soapy. You are a good friend and partner. And I won't tell about the nasty things well, we did together. So long. So long, partner, and don't forget. I won't, Soapy. And Billy didn't forget. Again, should we be one seeing of the this? Boys in our town now. He's one of the healthiest. And certainly, he's one of the happiest. And one of the kinkiest. Did they nuke this film in the end?
good. Jay Barker next. We don't make bad movies. We make bad movies better.